The Risk Runner. Oh boy, oh boy. The Risk Runner. Also known as the minigun guy. The heavy. The my weapon goes brr. And the I can solo this with my big gun person. In all seriousness, the Risk Runner does have a big gun and it can be used quite effectively if used right. And I'm not going to tell you how to effectively use it. You see, I'm here to teach you how to think like a Risk Runner. Ready? Let's go. Alright, so just because you can't aim ranged weapons doesn't mean you can't use traits such as Lone Wolf to keep that big gun burring. Is that a... Is that a word? You can't be grappled. What this means is that you should just run up to sledges and fight them in a battle of eagles. If you die, you die. If you win, you uh... Well, you know, win. I know I died. Okay, you weren't supposed to see that. You can combine your increased hipfire accuracy and recoil control with Lone Wolf, which makes your hipfire 65% more accurate, and Professional, which Reduces recoil by 65% for maximum overkill. Ah, I am unstoppable! No one can kill me. I'm an unstoppable heavy gunner god. Wait, there's a character like that already? Huh. Where did you look at that? Immediately equip the tormented trait because we have to be like the heavy. Look at him! Plus 20 HP doesn't do him justice. But it's the closest to becoming just like him. I mean, I, w I would like to say that that gut is his extra HP. And we can't really do that in Roblox, but you know, we'll go with it. We'll go for max health increase, because again, that's <laughs> that's the closest we can get. Realize that your outfit doesn't look cool, so change it to the heavies. Yeah. Okay, well this isn't even close, but we'll go with it. Now, big gun means a lot of ammo. What this means is that you need to steal ammo from artillerists. I mean it. If they get ammo to use in regular guns that don't go burr, then you're doing it wrong. Equip the eviction notice and the faster 15% moving speed just so you can steal ammo from artillerists because they love it when you do it. Also, it says that the Volca, the Risk Runner's big gun, is designed for sustained fire. I just want to say that you can tap it and mess around like you're not using a big gun. It's kind of fun to use it. You know, it's uh, kind of fun to use it the opposite of how it's supposed to. Be. I might get you killed though, so be careful. And my last tip is to learn how to manage your ammo. Wait, how did this get into the script? That doesn't sound right. You know, let's go with this. Step one, get ammo. Step two, rev gun and say, charge me doctor. Step three, mode on the enemy like there's no tomorrow. And step four, realize you wasted all your Volca's ammo on four dudes and question your life choices, but realize that what you just did was really fun, so you do it all again. So bam, there's a few amazing tips and <clears throat> tricks on the Risk Runner. Risk Runner is by principle a very straightforward perk. You have a big gun and that gun can unalive a lot of enemies. Simple. So if anything, just remember one thing. And I want you to really keep this to heart. What I'm about to say is the most important part about playing Risk Runner. You don't have a sandwich. <laughs> and for me, that makes the Risk Runner a 0 out of 10 sandwich class. Unaliving the enemy is great. I don't care about ammo management. Look at that. Recoil control. Nothing. I'm one-handing a minigun. So easy. You know, I honestly don't know why this video is so short. I had a lot of footage, but Risk Runner kind of just boils down into running around, grabbing ammo, shooting stuff, grabbing ammo, shooting stuff. Huh, I should have made more heavy jokes. Okay, I'm gonna write that down for next time. Anyways, hope you enjoyed and have a great super day, and uh, goodbye! Subscribe! You don't have to! But you should!